Hi, welcome to Chocolate Pimienta. Today I will show you how to make a delicious citrus and poppy seed laugh. To make the dough, we're gonna need 2 cups of flour, 1 tablespoon of cornstarch, 1 tablespoon of fresh yeast, 35 grams of sugar, half a cup plus 1 tablespoon of warm milk, 25 grams of unsalted butter, 1 small egg, 1 tablespoon of lemon and orange zest, and half a tablespoon of salt. We're gonna start the recipe by making a small amount of preferment. We're gonna put in a bowl the cheese and we're gonna cover it with the warm milk. Then we're gonna add the sugar and the flour. We're gonna mix this very well. Let them rest in a warm place until it double its size. Now we're gonna put all the dry ingredients in the mixer bowl and we add the preferment. We're gonna mix this a little bit with the hook attachment. Put the bowl in the mixer and we're gonna start to knead the dough. Now add the butter and mix, then add the eggs. Add the citrus zest and continue kneading. After 10 minutes kneading, the dough should look like this, very shiny and elastic. Transfer the dough to a clean bowl and cover it with a plastic paper. Let them rest for about one hour or until it double its size. To make the filling, we're gonna need 55 milliliters of milk, 3 tablespoons of sugar, 15 gram of poppy seed, 1 tablespoon of semola, 1 vanilla pot, 1 tablespoon of grated orange and lemon, and 2 tablespoon of rum. To make the filling, put in a pan the milk, then add the poppy seeds sugar oh it's so pretty <laughs> I love the poppy seeds and now we're gonna add the semola the citrus zest and we're gonna mix this very well cook this about 10 minutes or until it's very sticky smell very very good you see now it's very sticky and we're gonna add the vanilla. Finally add the rum and let them cool completely. Stretch the dough, helping you with a rolling pin. Spread the filling all around the dough. And now we're gonna start to roll in this beautiful loaf of poppy seed and citrus. 
Be gentle because the tail is very soft. Now, with a knife, cut the tail in half. Now we're gonna braid in the half of the tail onto each other. It's very easy to make. You see? Oh, it's so pretty! Transfer the tail to a tray. And now, we're gonna Cover the dough with a little bit of milk and butter to make this bread shine. Let them rest for about 30 minutes. Then bake for about 30 minutes or 45 minutes at 180 degrees. I hope you enjoyed the recipe. Please follow me on my social network. Subscribe! Bye!